hey guys so i am back on youtube man it has been crazy i have been gone for i think three months now and a lot has happened maybe even four months a lot has happened i now own a hairline it's called king's collection hair of course king karen so this is hair from my hairline this is a 10 inch full lace front wig bleached by me dyed jet black ya heard so yeah um where am i gonna start where am i gonna start well i left youtube because i was going through a lot of things during that time period and i wasn't really happy where i was and so i couldn't concentrate i didn't have the motivation to make videos and stuff like that i just it was just i wasn't happy you know so it's like what's the point of making videos and doing anything if i'm not happy so i left and so i took some time out i focused on myself i did some soul searching and i found myself and i found who i was again and i became much happier than i was and i started out my business by i don't know i just one day i was like i want to have something that's mine you know so i want to have something that I can say I made it my hard work and preservation and everything. Preservation? Is that? Perseverance. Perse I'm editing that out because I don't know if that's what I would say. But yeah, I wanted something that I know was mine and it was made from my foundation. Everything was true me. And nobody could ev ever tell me you wouldn't have that if it wasn't because of me. No. Everything I have is because of me. So yeah, I've had... I launched my hairline in September 17. And it was good. It was good. I get a few sales here and there. Get a few supporters. Of course, I get a few haters. You wouldn't be popping if you ain't got haters. So, yeah. This is my my business card for King's Collection Hair. At the moment, I'm invested in some bags. I don't know if you can see it. My ring light is so bright and it's like... Ugh. But at the moment, I'm investing in some packaging, nice bags for when I send out my bundles. The most, the product that sells the most in my hairline at the moment is 613 hair. Everybody wants to be blonde lately, but do you? If you look cute in your blonde, you stay doing your blonde. Don't let nobody tell you what to do, okay? And what else has happened? Since September, I've got more tattoos. I have a cross, a cross? There's something wrong with me. I have a crown here on my shoulder. I have my big one here. I have a little diamond because I'm a diamond in the roof. And I, my newest one is, I got my mom's name and her date of birth because I love my mama. And I have practice, patience, prosper going across my arm like that. That was something my grandmother always told me since young. She told me that if you practice and have patience, you will surely prosper. Like, it's pretty self-explanatory. You know? It's just that kind of thing when you don't give up no matter what. Like, there was a lot of times since i've been doing my business i felt like i wanted to give up it felt like it was too much the hate was too much i had money problems you know i didn't have support from the people that i expected to support me so that was kind of tough for me but i just always remember what, what she said practice patience and you'll prosper so i am prospering now i am happy my business is doing good i'm getting a lot of traffic i'm getting a lot of people starting to recognize it and stuff like that you know so yeah and i'm in university i study psychology so your girl a business girl she is psychologist to be and she a youtube star psychology it's nice like i feel like psychology is the type of subject that's only doable if you have an interest if you like it like later on i want to go into psychopathy i want to study psychopaths and how they think and why they do what they do and if we can help them and stuff like that it gets tough when i don't um prep and then i have an exam and then it's like but other than that i truly love it it's so interesting so exciting there's so many things to learn how our brains think why we think and we're, we're less in control of ourselves than we think we are there's just so much about psychology that uh, something, something in my eye uh, oh my god Oh my god, a damn motherfucking eyelash. Woo! You know when something gets in your eye and then your eye like starts to tear. These lashes are gorgeous, aren't they? Anyways, what was I saying? 
yeah there's so much that we feel like we think we're in control of so many things in our lives but we're actually not we're all conditioned to act a certain way and think a certain way what else i don't even know what else i've been doing i'm trying to catch you guys up on everything and i made some new friends in my university shout out to cc and peter and jocelyn and sarah and mary and um what else i don't know like i don't even know what i've been doing since i've been gone but well i'm back now and i'm gonna record this makeup look for you guys and i'm gonna upload it and let me know if there's anything you want to see since i'm back i'm gonna be doing some chit chat with king k I'm gonna be doing some like you know some challenges and stuff like that's not only gonna be about makeup and i'm gonna do some hair reviews of my own hairline <laughs> and yeah i'm trying to, i'm really trying to think what else is there i don't know my hairline college friends i don't know i don't think there's anything else um let me know if there's anything you want to know about what i've been doing and then i'll do a part two to this video so like my nails i'll do a part two to this video and then i can answer any questions about um anything that you guys want to know about where i've been yeah so this is the end of the video thank you so much for watching i love you guys i love the support that i've been getting people were texting me every day karen when are you gonna be back on youtube when you well i'm back bitch and i ain't going nowhere i'm here to stay okay so yeah make sure you subscribe and you comment and you share and you get all your lovely friends to watch my videos so i love you guys